Hello there, and welcome back to another Thunder's Productions tutorial. I'm the madman behind the mic, Jag Thunder, and this is Minecraft. And what's up, guys, and welcome back to another cool and fun tutorial. This one is on my version 2 V22 Osprey. Uh, this is an older one. It's, <laughs> it's been redone for quite a while, and I just didn't get around to getting a tutorial done on it. So we're going to drop right on down here, and we're going to get started. All right, as you can see, I've got two versions. I've got one in the uh, the parked version or the landed version, and then I've got one in a flying position. Uh, so basically, we're going to uh, build the uh, parked one first, and then we're going to rip off the side rotors, and we're going to put on these for the flying position. Really, really simple, and we're just going to cut it off right here when we're done. So let's go ahead and start our materials. We're just going to be using uh, all the quartz variances. I've got a block of coal for the wheel. We've got buttoned glass anvils, uh, nether brick slabs, and some stone brick stairs and uh, oak fence gate for some controls on the inside. We're going to start right off with a block of coal right here in the middle. We're going to use for a placeholder one, two, three, whoops, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to go to the outside. We're going to skip two spaces, one, two, and then we're going to put two blocks of coal just like that. So skip two spaces, one, two, and put two blocks of coal. Put your buttons on the inside and the outside for your wheels. And that totally missed. Get rid of your quartz in the middle and we'll do the next layer. All right, guys, starting right here on the inside of the wheel, go one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Going to go behind that by one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then going to go in front of that by two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Going to go off the back side, three, so right here is your middle, one, two, three, and then one right there in the middle, just like that, and then going to go back to the front by five, one, two, three, four, five, four sets of three. So right here, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then one right over the front wheel just like that. Go to your slabs, and you can put one slab right here, and then upside down stairs on each side just like that. All right, we got three slabs that are going to go right in here. One, two, three, right, <laughs> right there, and then three on this side. One, two, three, and then back to your stairs. And we're going to finish this off by putting one going to the front, and then one, two, three, four down the side, two down the back. And the second one right here, make sure it turns to the outside just like that. And then one more right here. So again, three slabs down your side here, and then four upside down stairs, two going this way. So you got one like that, one like this, and one off the back just like that. So again, from underneath, this is what it looks like. All right, next layer. All right, so starting right here on that upside down stairs that's facing the outside, we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. It should be even with the outside of this one right here. Same thing on this side. So on, on top of this upside down stairs that's facing the outside, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. All right, we got three across the front. 1, 2, 3. All right, and just on the inside, I've got some black wool for like the uh, the cockpit type area. We've got three across the front, just like that. And then back to your block of quartz. Skip two spaces and then put your backrest right here. Put your seats right in here. And then take your fence gates and put them just like that. So there is your cockpit area. All right, switch over to your slabs and we're gonna cover up on the outside. One, two, three, four. Same thing over here. One, two, three, four. All right, and now uh, back side of these here, we got a slab, and then we got a slab, and we've got a solid block right here in the middle, just like that, and then an upside down stair here, and an upside down stair piece right there. All right, back to your slabs, just the inside, you can put two pieces right here, just cover up those little holes, go back to the solid pieces, and starting on top of the slab, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Should stop right here next to the chair. Same thing on this side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then we're going to switch over to our glass. We're going to put two pieces here, two pieces here, one piece here, one piece here. All right, and then across the front here, we're going to put an upside down stair piece here. We're going to turn and face one going this way, and then we're going to face and turn one going that way, and then one on top. So it looks just like this from underneath. All right, back to the back here. Go ahead, whoop, go ahead and build these up by one. And then off the back, we're going to put one here, one here, and then one in the middle just like that. All right, and then we're going to have a slab and a slab here and then a stair, stair, and then a slab on the upper hit boxes. So again, right here, slab, stair, slab, stair, and then a slab. So it looks just like that so far. 
All right, back to your solid block. We're going to go right on top of this one right here. One, whoops, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Should stop right there above that slab. Same thing on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then we're going to fill in across here. And right above the glass here, we're going to cover up all the glass pieces. Just like that. And then above that in the upper hit box right here, we're going to put three pieces across here one here and then we got two more in the middle just like that so you're gonna have an open spot right here for right now all right going down the side on the fifth block one two three four five right here we're gonna have an upside down stair same thing right here all right for a placeholder we're just going to use a block of coal and go out one two three and then we're going to go back to our solid and we're going to put three blocks this way and then two like that so you're just going to make a plus all right we got a piece of slab on the bottom and then an upside down stair piece going towards the front Oops, so it looks just like that. All right, same thing on the other side. Use coal for a placeholder. One, two, three. And then solid block. One, two, three. One forward, one back. And then a stair on the front. And then a slab underneath. Get rid of our coal block pieces. So again, so far it looks like that. All right, let's go back here. Grab your solid block, and we're going to cover these up. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oops, we need to cover up right there. And then to the inside of that, three down the middle. So just cover up these two pieces here and add one more out the back. All right, switch over to your slabs, and we're going to put four pieces on the upper hit box. One, two, three, three, four. Get rid of that one. We don't need that. And then two on the outside on the last two. Two on the outside on the last two. All right, again, switch over to your coal. And we're going to go one, two, three. And then we're going to solid block one, two, going towards the back. Upside down stair piece and then upside down stair piece. Get rid of the coal. Go back over here, this side. One, two, three. And then a solid piece, one going to the back. Upside down stair piece, upside down stair piece, and then get rid of your coal. All right, so so far that's what it should look like. All right, switch back over to your solid block, and we're gonna put three on the back and then in a regular stair piece on the front. Same thing over here, one, two, three, and then a regular stair piece. All right, then on the first block right here, we're gonna go ahead and connect across the back wing section right there by one and then right behind that by one all right after you connect these two we're gonna put three slabs right here one two three and we're gonna do that two more times so one two three one two three and then we're gonna put one here one here and then I put a saw block in the middle just like that and then we're gonna go three blocks three times just like that so nine blocks and then four up the middle one two three four and then one to the outside and one to the outside. Fill that in with slabs right here. Cover that hole up. Back to your saw blocks and go one, two, three, one, two, three. So your middle block should cover up the upside down stair on the outside, just like that. And then we have a regular stair piece here, a regular stair piece here. And we got slabs that are gonna cover up in the middle. So nine pieces right down through here. Got a solid block right here in the middle, and then two slabs on each side, here and here. All right, go forward by two, and that'll cover up that hole, and then fill in the middle right there. Back to your solid block, and go to the outside by six. One, two, three, four, five, six, so it should land right on top of this. And then just build this up, three to the front, and three to the back. And then one more right here on top of that upside down stair piece, so on the other side. Six to the outside, one, two, three, four, five, six, three, three, and then one. All right, and then you're gonna switch over to your slabs and then fill this in, one, two, three, one, two, <laughs> one, two, three, and same thing over here, and up to the front. All right, back to your solid, and we're just gonna uh, cover this up with the same thing we did on the bottom so we're just going to make a plus sign right here just like that and we're going to put stairs facing the back or the front whichever way you want to call it just facing the inside just like that and then one on the front right here so same thing on this side so we've got the plus sign just like that and then put your stair pieces in three right there and two on the back all right on the back rear wings we've got two solid pieces and then a stair two solid pieces <laughs> and then a stair piece right there all right one more solid piece and a stair and over here and then a stair 
and then we're going to go back up here and we're going to put a plus again on top of this to finish off the top of the rotor head. All right, we got one more block that sits on top of here and here, and then grab your anvils and you can put one on top. And you don't, you can put it that way or you can put it this way. I like to face mine going that way to the front, just like that. Switch over to your slabs. All right, and then I'm just going to do just this one side, and then you can do the other one. They're both the same. So we're going to go right off the front and over by one. So we're going to go here and over by one, just like that, and then go back by two. Same thing on this side here, and I'm just kind of creeping in the air. So just go straight across and put two just like that. And then you're going to go four at a diagonal. So one, two, three, and four. Same thing over here. One, two, three, and and four and then off the back we're going to have eight pieces so right here one two three four five six seven and eight so again that's what it looks like and that is your osprey in the parked position so again it should look like this when it is finished just like that all right we're going to go ahead and rip off the rotor head and we're going to switch it over to this position here which is really really easy so go ahead and take your uh your propellers off here and then this one and then everything from here out so you're going to have two slabs here and then everything to the outside go ahead and remove so again you're going to have two slabs exposed and everything to the outside uh, removed so go ahead and take uh, <laughs> remove that rotor head and remove this rotor head all right so that's what you should have we're going to go back and use our coal and we're going to go one two three and then we're going to go down by one and then we're going to put a saw block just underneath that and that's where we're going to start our position for so go ahead and get rid of that put an upside down stair piece in the front and an upside down stair piece in the back and same thing on the other side and it's the same but I'll go ahead and do it with you so one two three and then go down by one and then a solid block get rid of those and then upside down stair piece and same thing on the back fly jag <laughs> there we go all right back over here all right back to your solid block and the next is next part is really really easy so just go three down the middle and build it up by three just like that you're going to go out by one here, out by one here, and build that up by three. Again, so you just put a big plus on top of this bottom section. All right, and then down the middle here of these three pieces, you're going to put one here and two going forward. One, two, same thing over here. One, two, three, and one to the back. I missed one right there. And then you can uh, connect this and fill this in solid right here. And get rid of that block because you're going to have a slab right here to the inside on the lower hit box. All right, you're going to have a stair piece on each side right here. One more solid block in the front and one in front of that. And a stair piece right here off the middle. And then we've got our solid block right here. I think I forgot one right there in that corner. So again, right across here, we've got three solid blocks. One, two, three, where it connects in. And a slab in the front. And again from the back. All right, actually get rid of this solid block right here and the only thing you should have is just this slab right here in the front and that should actually be moved back by one so go ahead and put it right here all right and then just to finish this off we got some upside down stair pieces that are going to go right here and right here and that is it to finish off the side rotor head and you're going to do the same thing on the other side i'm going to build it with you just because it was a little confusing so i'm just going to go up the middle by three two three just like that and then three up the uh the center right here and we got one here and one here and same thing in the back just like that got a solid piece here we've got a slab on the lower hip box here uh, right here we got three pieces one going forward and one more right there two stair pieces here and here and also underneath here and here So again, from the side, it looks like that. And then one stair piece off the back, just like that. That was so much easier to build than the other one. <laughs> I struggled a little bit. All right, and then we're just gonna have our slabs down here. And the easiest way to do this is just go ahead and put three just like that and get rid of that one right here and set your anvil on top of it right here. And you're gonna go down each side by four. And I'm just gonna go ahead and set some blocks here just to the inside because we're gonna have stair pieces going down. So. This is probably the easiest way to do it, is just build some stairs off to the side. And then go ahead and grab your stair pieces. So again, our nether brick, one, two, three, and four. 
and same thing on the other side. So it's right on top, one, two, three, and four. And then you can go ahead and get rid of the blocks in between. And then take your solid block and go straight up the middle, one, two, three, and four. And again, that should be another brick. I don't have it in my inventory, but that's what it should look like anyways. And you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So we'll go ahead and look at this one. So again, you got four stairs going down, four stairs going down, and then four pieces going up. And again, a secondary look at this uh, side rotor uh, head. And then the inside, underneath. And I think there's an extra slab right here that I might have forgotten. But you can count the blocks. It's really, really easy. And then from the back, that's what it looks like. And again, over here. And around the outside. And that is it. Really, really easy tutorial. Pretty quick, guys. Uh, much better than the first version. I uh, really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Like always, remember to rate, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Later.